So it's raining out tonight and I'm bored. So I decided to make a little video because people seem really interested in our little travel trailer. So welcome to our travel trailer. Um, it is a Gulfstream, a 2021 Gulfstream Enlighten, and it's 25 feet long. This is the bedroom, and what's great about this is the bed actually lifts up. Probably can't see it very well there, but ah, there we go. There's storage underneath the bed, and then you just bring it down. Got some closets, very small closets. Um, you can't have too many clothes in a travel trailer. So you kind of have to pick and choose. These blinds are really neat. They just go up and down. Just pull them up and down like that. These windows come out. It's kind of muggy tonight. So I've got them closed and the AC on, but these come out on the nice nights and you get that fresh air. So nice. And there's some storage up here. And my husband's very messy area over here. But our cat, Timothy, enjoys being in there. And that's his little sleeping spot right in there. He's not in there right now, though. Okay, so we've got a little privacy curtain here. Uh, we've got a TV back here that we still need to hook up. But yes, a little privacy curtain. You can pull it. Excuse me, I have bronchitis. You can pull that um, to get a little privacy. There's another privacy curtain right here. Um, I'm a big fan of hanging things. Of course, this is a small space, so you need a lot of those. Uh, um, I forget the, the brand name of it, but those hooks that come off very easily and don't leave marks. We've got lights here, and we can um, heat water with this guy here. Takes a few minutes to heat the water up there. And we can retract and extend our awning. We have an awning outside. And these are all of our lights right here. And then right here, we've got a little radio. And we've got speakers on the outside and the inside built in. There's one there, there's one over there, and this is the little kitchen area. How cute. I got this little mat on Amazon, and it's been a lifesaver. It just, you can just roll it up, and you can store dishes in here, uh, dirty or clean. I did the dishes tonight, so there's nothing in there right now. But yeah, and you can use it as a second little storage area dry it's it's marketed as a drying area drying rack and then uh we added this little touch here this is a a bar a magnetic bar here that we added so we just have everything um, at hand while we're cooking my husband really wanted the stove so that's why we went with this model we were looking at a less expensive model but he wanted a stove, a full stove, an oven, so we got this guy. And this is really neat. That just lights up, so if you're cooking in the dark, you can see what you're doing. There's a little oven, and you can store stuff in there when you're not using it. It's got three burners, and then when you're not using it, this glass, this glass top just comes down. You can use it as a surface which is super cool. I also purchased on Amazon these little spice, plastic spice racks. You just stick them up there with little stickies and it really holds very well. Uh, we got a great microwave. It's pretty powerful actually. Not a lot of storage for food as you would expect, but I bought a, a can rack on Amazon and that's been serving its purpose pretty well. That's our food storage area. Uh, we've got a great refrigerator. It's almost as big as our 
old refrigerator in our old apartment. And yeah, plenty of storage space. Bigger than a mini fridge. Most most things, uh, most trailers just have a mini fridge in them. We've got a full size freezer. It's awesome. My husband and I love ice, so we've got ice in there on demand. Speaking of ice, this little baby kicks pretty well. Uh, this is our AC unit, and most of the time we don't even need it to be at full blast because it gets so cold in here in this little space. Entering our living room, uh, this is our couch. We've got it covered with a sleeping bag because our little kitty cat, Timothy, enjoys clawing it up, and I didn't want our new uh, couch all clawed up, so we've got it covered course obligatory uh, accessories boom boom uh, we got another lovely window here that slides out um, I've got some tchotchke up here some little gnomes that I've acquired or was given or found and you can put your own little touches on things and uh, oh I forgot this couch actually folds down and there's also storage eh, underneath. Can't really see it, but yeah, there's storage underneath and it folds down uh, flat. So it's another sleeping area for somebody. Uh, we've got a nice little kitchen right here, our little kitchen table here. And we've got it covered again because Tim enjoys scratching. Um, and underneath here, there's storage. This table, we haven't tried it yet, but this table does come apart. And this area can be another little sleeping space for a small person. We've got our fun lights, party time lights. Yeah, and a lot of people have been interested in inquiring about uh, cats in trailers. So we just put his litter box right there underneath the uh, refrigerator. It fits very well. And then uh, he usually just goes to the bathroom outside. Um, but occasionally, you know, yeah, it gets a little stinky. We will put it just outside and let it air out. And, oh, I forgot this. Another little closet area for <clears throat> coats and shoes or whatever. <clears throat> and, oh, the bathroom, yes. This is a great luxury. AC is a great luxury, as well as having a toilet. So great. Uh, we've got like a 27, 28 tank, holding tank for gray water and black water. Uh, black water is toilet and gray water is everything else. Plenty of space in here. Let's get some light on. Yeah. So we've got uh, in here, plenty of storage in there. I bought this at Dollar Tree, I think it was, or some super cheap somewhere. Oh, big lots, big lots, yes. And that just holds things. Uh, we do have a shower curtain. I've got it tied up currently. Um, I have used the tub. This is a nice feature. Some uh, place, some trailers don't have the tub, uh, but this model does, and I have used it once. It works. It's great. We're using it for storage currently which you can do. Oh, and this is a nice feature. We've got a little sunlight there that comes in. And this is great as well for keeping moisture out. Um, you can open this up and I can't reach it right now, but you can open it up and let fresh air in and run the fan. Keeps all the moisture out. Plenty of storage space. Boom, 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 more storage space. Oh, under the sink, yeah. There's appliances and pots and pans. Plenty of space down there. And we've got some little drawers here. Can't put too much in there, but you can put some stuff. Boom, boom. And, oh, we have a fan. Oh, and when it was a little bit colder, we had a heater. That little baby kicks, too. It gets it real warm in here. You'll be warm in about five minutes. Turn that thing on. So I've got rugs all over the floor to protect it. 
and yeah that's a, that is about it for the tour of the inside of our little gulf stream travel trailer and i hope you enjoyed it this is the door there's a screen here a little pass through here they call it a beer pass um oh and one more skylight there and it's great when it's raining to listen to the little drops oh, there's one uh on the roof it's very relaxing so that is about it for the tour of the 2021 enlightened gulf stream hope you enjoyed have a great day